Welcome back to Scoreline. My name is Robin Son. Okay, in this part of the show, I want us to shift gears. We take a look at uh, some basketball action. And now the Kenya Basketball Federation Premier League is uh, currently taking place at uh, the Nyayo National Gymnasium in uh, Robi. Earlier on, uh, Davis Samberia was uh, at the gymnasium. He had a chance of speaking to USIU who are playing equity and they've had back-to-back -back losses. Davis, what uh, do the... USIU ladies have to say on their recent performances. Well, a very good afternoon, my colleague Robinson of Kenya. Yes, we are at the Nyayo uh, Indo Arena where the Kenya Women's Basketball League is ongoing. The match pitting uh, USIU, who are actually playing against equity, is ongoing. And if my camera person will just show you what is happening right now, uh, equity are leading with 43 points against 31, which are for the USIU. Remember, USIU are actually in the second position position with actually 15 points which they have amassed after winning 10 matches and this will be a pick a point for them after uh, losing their game against KPA in their last uh, basketball uh, league match played in Mombasa. Just to delve more into this I'll be joined by the player and also someone from the technical bench just to tell us what it actually means and what are their targets this season. Thank you so much. Welcome on uh, KT News scoreline you'll just introduce yourself and tell us how about uh, the season has been and today's match just introduce yourself first uh, my name is Christine Omondi I'm a player of USIU Africa uh, today we are playing against Ikuti this is our second time meeting we lost to them in first leg so we want to win this second game against them yeah we're looking forward to winning this game of course, uh, there are those things you've worked on after losing against KPA. What are these uh, things you think make you to propel into this match and win? Uh, we've actually worked on our defense. We want to stop them, stop their runs. We have to. We've worked on our offense as well, the shooting, because last time they 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 had better shots than us. So this time we want to beat them with our shots and our defense. This season, what are your targets? This season, uh, we want to be top three. Yeah, that's our target, top three. Because according to the losses we have, we have to be top three. Yeah, so that we can be in playoffs and uh, go for the title at the end of it. Yeah, go for the title. <laughs> thank you so much and all the best. Thank you, thank you. To actually talk more about uh, what are they using actually today uh, to win and uh, some of the tactics they have enacted today, I'll be joined by one of the members from the technical bench. Just introduce yourself, uh, tell us uh, how is the match so far, do you think your girls are playing par, what you actually um, meant uh, or guided them uh, to do today, just introduce yourself. Um, my name is Tasha Mapendi. And I'm part of the technical bench. I'm the team manager. And I think today we're, we really worked on defense throughout the week. And uh, we're looking forward to, as you can see, our defense has improved from our last game with KPA. And we are banking on defense. Defense is what wins games, yeah. Of course, a big achievement coming from Division 1 and actually uh, coming in and being among the big weights in position 2. What has been the secret for USIU maybe? I think patience especially when training the team and also emphasizing on the fact that even if you are now coming from Division 1, you still have the chance to win it. The game of basketball is about who wants it more and having our young players, I think we want it. And that's, how, that's what has brought us this far. Your parting shot? Um, defense wins game and we hope you all enjoy the game with the SIE. <laughs> Thank you so much and all the best. Thank you very much. That was uh, one of the technical bench members just sharing with us uh, some of the technicals they have used today and actually what they are aiming this season and actually to win this match that is ongoing. Remember, after this game, we will be witnessing the men's uh, side which will be pitting Ulinzi who will be playing against Anu. So we will be here to bring up to date our viewers what will be happening concerning the Kenya Basketball League on the women's side and on the men's side. Back to you, Robinson of Kenya in studio. Thank you very much, uh, Davis Miria at uh, the Nyayo Gymnasium. Now, I want us to shift gears. We get into some uh, Premier League action.